can uh, move forward to get into that top eight in this story, man, but we'll see. I mean, Ryuga always performs super solidly in doubles. First it was with Tweak, now it's with Salem pretty yeah. consistently. And I mean, I remember they got, I believe, fourth place at Super Smash Con. Yeah. So this is a strong team. Yeah, yeah, that was the absolutely. largest Smash 4 tournament of the year, at least for singles. Not sure about teams, but I would assume that it's that was same. also the same, yeah. Either way, it looks like we're kicking it off here. Game one on Battlefield. Oh, and <laughs> starts off by Witch Twisting his partner. Not quite sure if that's the ideal opening gambit, but yeah. we'll take it. And interesting, okay, so Larry actually still, uh, oh. that's why he's utilizing uh, Lucina throughout the doubles. Looks like he's gonna go ahead with his Fox this time around. Maybe he saw something. Maybe it's because he's dealing with Salem. Uh, maybe we're dealing with uh, Ruga as well, the Corrin. That may be the reason for the pick. He lied to us on the pre-match form. Oh yeah, he definitely <laughs> lied to us. And made yeah, us like fools. I believe Corrin players do typically lament having to fight against Fox and yeah. just quick characters in general. I think Lucina does very well against her as well, but I mean, Larry, of course, knows his matchups much better with Fox than any other character. That's All what's right. gotten him to, you know, top five, top six in the world True. status. Okay, here comes a big combo from Ally. No, no forward air to close it out. Salem wise to it. Just gonna mash on the air dodge. Yep. Oh, and no KO off of that. Looked like a really good opportunity for Salem, but red team just SDI on point. I know Ally was looking completely helpless in Bayonetta combos for a couple months, a couple yeah, weeks. True. And then he must have gone home and hit the lab because I've seen it happen a lot less frequently to him. Yes, he's definitely gotten a lot better. And you need to <laughs> in order to survive in the 2017 meta yep, game, almost absolutely. 2018. Okay, okay quick good forward wait. throw away. Yeah, very smart. Salem was probably anticipating back throw because that's what a lot of teams will do uh, if the Mario grabs his partner just yeah. to hit the you hit away. Box. Exactly. Oh, I like the down air attempt, but unfortunately with no rage on Mario, that's going to be a while before it kills. Yeah, no, he wasn't. Larry was actually not able to get a quick off that, so fortunate for him. Okay, Witch Twists after Burner Kicks galore, but not enough to carry uh, Larry all the way off the top of the screen. Okay, here's okay, another here chance. Yep, there's oh. a string, wow. Wow, the Smash DI up from Ally, even at only 29%, enough to pop him out of Salem's reach, and Salem losing a stock immediately afterward. Yeah, great so, job there, Larry. Still a very, very even game right now, though. I feel like we usually see Ryuga follow suit with Cosmos and play the stock tank of this team, mm -hmm. but still, right now he's getting clobbered up, almost down to his last stock already. Yeah, I felt like for a little uh, brief period of time throughout this game, we've seen like, Larry almost kind of focus on on Ryuga specifically because he's been able to get like really quick damage, as you can see right here too. So I think maybe because Salem tends to be more uh, reserved and stay back. They've used that opportunity to get damage on him. So that's why he's not being able to stock tank. Yeah, they're definitely just trying to rush him down. And I like that strategy. If you know that that's the role somebody plays in a given team, just target them. Exactly. And then it throws them out of their comfort zone, particularly the player who's used to having a stock to take from them. Yeah. So let's see if Ryuga's able to kind of shift gears or find his comfort zone here. Oh, misses the pin. That was crucial. Even though it wouldn't have killed, it would have fended Larry off. They could have gotten an opportunity to get okay. rid of Ally. Instead, we've got both of them dying simultaneously, and again, this match is very close to even. It's just that Salem is a little bit closer to death than Larry is for the time being. And yeah, of course, we'll it changes so quickly. Yeah. Okay, Salem is running across the stage. Yeah, he's definitely trying to hunt Larry down. Not going to be able to get an ender, though. Uh-oh. Good oh. catch. I love it. Yes, and I think that's a big part of why Larry picked Fox here over Lucina, just because that vertical acceleration, Fox can get up there way quickly and, or way more quickly than Lucina can. Right. And his up air is also more devastating. So if you know that your partner might be getting roofed by Bayonetta, it's a quick save for that Fox up air. And again, we saw some good DI come out of Ally on that uh, second wish twist. We didn't get hit by the up air, was able to come down really early despite it. Uh, being at the percent that if he did not get DI correctly, he could have gotten up air and that could have been the stock. So, really good stuff by Ally. Utilizing that proper DI to actually save that life, save that stock. Yeah, definitely showing that he's done his homework. And for good reason, too. You know, there was that period over the summer where he was looking like he might be falling off a little bit. But now we actually have a double okay. KO in a 1v1 situation. Larry versus Salem. These guys have squared off many a time, and it generally goes in the favor of Salem. Mm -hmm. 
This was Selm's only loss in bracket at EVO 2017, by the yeah, way. Yeah. Oh, off stage. No, Larry overcompensating with the angle, trying to not get battlefielded, knowing that the right side is kind of janky. Uh, and you can see the Damn. upsetness in Larry's generally very stoic face. I mean, just the little bit of emotion bleeding through is that pure just dissatisfaction. Sucks. Yeah. That sucks. He could have gone straight up. Yeah. I think he would have been fine. It wasn't at a part where the edge was goofy. Actually, I think the left side is the one that's more messed up on Battlefield. But definitely some weird stuff can happen with those walls. Yeah, and your guy's happy with the substitute playing the game now. Yeah, he, he doesn't even anyone. need he's to like, be yeah. in there himself. Yeah, he's like, this is these guys are trash. Larry throws his stocks away at 15. Okay, no big deal. Like, I, I don't need to be present. <laughs> All right, well, Salomon Ryuga taking that first game in a very unconventional fashion, but I'm sure there are no complaints from them. Oh, my God. Larry getting wow. beaten. Yeah, he got duffed. Yeah, he got <laughs> smashed by his partner into the Witch Fist. Okay. He's on his revenge tour now, just yep. up airing. <laughs> But I don't know if that's enough, man. He's already at 89%, and yeah, Ryuga's trying to scheme on that recovery. Oh, absolutely. We'll be able to get in time, though. Yeah, very exploitable off of the stage, especially for a character with a large disjoint like Corrin's forward smash and side B. Oh, the saves from Larry have been so consistent. Oh, no. Unfortunate. Ryuga and was hitting up the... Throughout that up air, I uh, was able to get Ally, but also got Salem as well. Don't think I lost the stock. All right, let's see. Can Ally get Larry out of jail as well? It looks like he didn't even need to. Nope. It's these miscommunications from both teams really costing them a lot. Oh, here comes a big opportunity. No, Ally again getting Larry that. out of trouble. Well done. Yeah, not allowing him to get that double back air. But regardless, he's going to lose that stock where he's in now. Five stocks to two. Definitely a... Definitely a little close. I think that even though we have Ally right now on kind of on the side of the stage, for the most part, I think that he's been the one who's kind of been most consistent. He's getting really clutch saves, right? He's getting a lot of great conversions as well, too. We haven't really seen that come out of uh, Blue Team yet. I feel like they're still kind of getting those miscues a lot. Yeah, I agree. They're looking way less practiced and polished than they typically do, but still, this is pretty much a dead heat. And as long as they can keep the pace up, they should win this match and close out the set. Blue team, of course. Yeah. I don't know, man. Larry and Ally look like they are shaping up a bit. They just Now that blue team has all the stage control, never mind Larry turning it around and fighting himself out of a bad sandwich position. Okay, this is dangerous. Ooh, Salem, can you get this kill? Oh, yeah, I, I guess so. What, yeah. Pure fear factor. Oh, oh no. no. And Ally intimidated into dying as well. Wow. What a turnaround. Four to two. Man, that was absolutely tragic. And they've got to get rid of Salem right now and Ryuga quickly afterward. Yeah. Their sense are climbing, but any time that they get a hit, it's some serious lost ground. Yeah. And it's such good timing now for Salem, because now we've seen from Salem, he's actually switching around and putting himself in a place where the moment he sees them throw out attacks, he's been moving back and just, he's like, okay, you're going to run away from me? Then he goes into ABK. Quite Still. frankly, I don't know how he can see anything. Oh, I think they <laughs> okay, just yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we're back. Oh, we're yeah. back. <laughs> we definitely right. couldn't see anything. <laughs> Everybody uh, just paused. Pure mm -hmm. respect. Right. And this is actually super close. If you look at the percents and oh, stocks, man, I think they're just going to take a gentleman's restart, you know, take a side of the field each and then count from three. Yeah, these guys, you know, they've been in the game for so long. It's right. like, it's not that serious. Yeah. It's definitely that serious, but, you know, not like, oh, uh, we got to reset the whole game. Technical difficulties. Yeah, exactly. Either way, we're back into it. And a quick up smash, closing out Salem. They're on the verge of bringing this one back, but they've got to protect Larry. Okay, Excellent there it is. Follow All right. There we are. We have one suck of peach for everybody. Oh, Salem getting out of that. But I was going to say, Ally needs to pass him off to Larry before Ryuka respawns. Oh, they drop the team combo. Larry and Ally, they're so close. They're just making a couple misplays that really are keeping them from evening this one up here. Yeah. All right, let's see, what do you guys have? All of a sudden, the percents are looking a lot better for them. This comeback might be real, but so might this roof combo. Yeah, not gonna do it though. Yep, Okay. Ally just barely getting out. People dare, okay, I, I love Ally seeking him out, trying to go himself, just make sure he's not gonna get these uh, roof combos, really good stuff. Did you see the bravado on that up smash from yeah. Ally? Oh, yeah, he's right over him. He's the going, man. He doesn't care. 
Ally recognizes that as long as he's able to protect Larry from getting killed off these wish wish combos, he's going to be in a good position. That's wow. a kill. Larry just runs up and does it. No yeah. regard for anything Ryuga could have done in that situation. And now we've got a 2v1 on the other side. Let's see how Larry and Ally are able to deal with the very evasive Salem. Definitely a player who's not afraid to camp it out, fight from the ledge. Yeah, so this is actually really good. I love that he's going to put out the flood here because now if he continues to do so, he can just flood him out. Yeah, easy to get a stock. Oh, that should be killed. Oh, yep, yep. <laughs> I love that from Ally. Put those guns away. Yeah, just has the presence of mind to mash out a forward smash when only the little hitbox of the guns is able to uh, hit him from up close. Okay, well, I guess we've got a 1-1 one -one set after some serious ups and downs. All these matches are straight up roller coasters, man. I feel like I'm oh, at yeah. six flags here. Oh, I know, absolutely. Whether it be the game itself or the, the damn screen. <laughs> right, yeah. <laughs> but we're back. Even streamers can make tech errors, dude. Oh, it's, there's so many things. Of course, you have to deal with the venues. That's the thing sometimes people don't recognize that. Yeah. We're all in different venues. People are traveling here. There's so many variables. Yeah, I feel like right? the stream monsters who are most likely to complain about it have never seen like the backstage setup of a Chinese, oh, no, just course. how involved oh, it is. Of course not. It's like course eight not. million wires, bro. You know, yeah. one of them is gonna come unplugged once no. in a while. Anyways, we're gonna go into this game three here. Of course, we're at double soft 12. We're gonna Salem. Ally and Larry, who? Who's gonna move for? Who you got, fam? Who I got? Oh, come on, man. You already know yeah, I got Ally and Larry, man. You know. already knew the answer, but. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, if you want me to tell you, I'll tell you again. And of course, that would be the red team as Bam's pick. Right. That's SoCal Bias, man. Of course, you're keeping it off the mic, so nope. you can't even say anything. <laughs> oh, but there goes Ally, man. Oh, to be man. honest, I was going to say I got Ryuga and Salem. I value the uh, team synergy, the rehearsal. I value time. the six stocks as well, too. Yeah, very <laughs> yeah, true. You're a wise man, dude. Good. <laughs> Definitely pass that first grade math class. <laughs> yeah. No doubt about it. Yeah. All right, old oh, Larry barely hanging on, and Corrin's up here, man. That's one of those moves where you could either die at 80 or 180, depending on your DI. Yeah, right. <laughs> that's <laughs> real serious. Yeah, yeah, you have to know what you're doing with that move. There are quite a few in that in this game like that, but I'd say that's one of the most pronounced examples. And True. there we go, an up throw, closing Larry out. But the quick revenge from Ally, and all okay. of a sudden, we've got nearly an even game. Of course, Ryuga, though, the perennial stock tank just yes. hanging on to his first one still. At 82% at that. Yeah, definitely not in danger of dying to either of the red team's up smashes, yep. which are pretty much their most reliable kill moves. Exactly. Though his percent is climbing, and it looks like they're just going to gang up on Salem instead. Like, yeah, Corrin, hang back with your three stocks. We don't really care. You're not yep. fast enough to break this zone or that to is really true. get in there and interrupt. Yeah, that's really going to be the kind of weakness that you're going to see from Corrin. Even though Corrin has these ranges, the sheer movement from Corrin is really lacking. So. Yeah, and she pretty much has to commit to Dragon Lunge to move very quickly across exactly. the screen. Which you don't want to do. That's not how you want to get over nope, there and break the team all. combo. Especially not against confident players. Oh, you're dead! Gonna die? <laughs> <laughs> that was nutty. Were you, what were you doing, bro? <laughs> Both of these characters have reflectors. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that was sick. And then Salem saying, hey man, I don't care about your reflectors. I have Bayonetta combos off the top. And I don't even need the full piece, right? I have Ryuga to set me up, and then I can just get a quick side B or up B into up air and close yep. it out. Ooh, that late hit of up air, so gorgeous from Salem, making sure to interrupt that team combo. How's it gonna finish, though? This yep. is still almost anybody's game, as long as they keep Larry alive and get rid of Salem. Yeah, they have, just like that, man. Yeah, that's some serious gone. conditions to be. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Yeah, things are kind of looking grim for red team here. Yeah, it's not a good look so far. However, you know, two quick kills. I don't want to count anybody out. Doubles is definitely comeback city. Yes, absolutely. Just takes a couple good breakaways to make up for a lot of lost ground. But are they even going to get said breakaways? Ryuga and Salem looking just so practiced, not only in their follow-ups, but just their team neutral. They know how to cover each other so well. Yeah, I'm seeing a really good flow from them overall. And yeah, that save from Salem right there. Gonna make sure Larry has to think twice about any time he hits Ryuga and vice versa. Okay, they're going for a chase here. Automatic. Oh, okay. the up throw and then the quick up yeah. smash revenge, but now we've got a very ugly 2v1. Yes, we do. Larry is just a pin away from dying or a witch time into whatever. Oh yeah, chomp up, cookie yeah. monster. 